These are delicious. Mm. Have you ever thought about starting a baking business? No, I've never thought about that. Is it me or are the gals never happy? Not when the gals are only making 56% of what the men make. So you won't be happy till you make 100% of what men make? Yes. yes. Don't forget to smile. What? Smile with teeth. You want to practice? Mrs. Schlafly ran for the Congress twice in the state of Illinois. That's right. And lost both times. Uh, she thanked all the people who voted for her, and her husband thanked all the people who did not vote for her. <laughs> right, Mark, yeah. Do you know what I had to do to get my commission funded? I had to let more than a dozen congressmen put a hand on my arm, my hip, my backside. More than a dozen demanded to see my pretty smile before they agreed to sign on. Well, your wife has a very strong and, and dominant kind of style. She wear the pants in your family? Oh, no, she doesn't. Uh, I'm uh, obviously uh, physically larger than she is. Yeah, well, he chins himself 25 times every morning. And uh, <laughs> she's very uh, uh, submissive. S submissive? Oh, Wonder Woman's my idol, but you know, she's not a real person. She's better than a real person. She's a superhero, and she's got great legs. We're going with this cover. Oh, I see. You want to be the only one around here with great legs. I gave Gloria her first byline assignment because I saw her standing outside my office one day and I thought she had great legs. They don't want their number two to have a mouthy pro-choice feminist for a wife. They didn't say mouthy. They said outspoken. But I told them I don't control my wife, so there. I just wish she'd said she's not outspoken. She's the normal amount of spoken. She speaks about as much as any man. Now, our superiority in MIRVs does not compensate for the Russian superiority in ICBMs, SS9s. Hey, listen, could, could you take notes for us? You know, so that we have an unofficial record. Well, you probably have the best penmanship of anyone here. Oh, yes, of course. And Margaret can grab you a pen. Under the ERA, the poor girls would have to support the family 50%. Oh, but now. But wouldn't we be getting something for that for uh, First time. Well, perhaps. Uh, uh, let, let me just say. <laughs> Jim. Congressman. Excuse me. I'm used to suffering for the cause. It's one thing not to be able to control yourself, but your secretary. <laughs> well, you know the best way to shut your secretary up? Put a muzzle on her. No. Nope. <laughs> Dump her in the Potomac. No, no, no. Stick it in their mouth. <laughs> I have raised six children. They're almost all grown. You are too old. Who applies to law school at 50? You can't stop me from going. Well, who's going to pay for it? You both have some opinionated wives. But seriously, let's bring the fellas in on this and have them get a word in. 